You know what, brothers? Life is nothing but a series. Life is nothing but a collection of new beginnings. I don't care if you're talking about, I don't care if you're talking about a five year, 10 year, 20 year span of time that covers a new chapter in life. I don't care if you're talking about a, a few, a few weeks or a few months where you had to go through a certain thing or you had a huge victory. It's all about, it's all about being, being in a collection or a series of new beginnings, brothers. I don't care if you're talking about just inhaling and exhaling and having a new thought. It's all about having a new beginning. And I'll be honest, brother, nothing represents a new beginning more than Tej Hanley. And you always hear me talk about it. You know, when I wake up in the morning, man, and I'm putting that AM moisturizer on my face, man, it represents me stepping into that new version of myself. When I get in the shower, man, and I'm using that exfoliator and taking all that dead skin off, brother, it represents me stepping into my new I am. And I'll be honest, that's why I'm proud. That's why I'm glad to have Tej Hanley sponsor today's video. Believe me, man, Tej Hanley is the truth. You've heard me talk about them before, and you're going to be hearing me talk about them for a long time because I know the positive impact they've had on my life. Seriously, I don't think some of you brothers believe me when I tell you how much implementing a quality skincare routine will improve confidence in all areas of your life. Tej Hanley makes taking care of your skincare uncomplicated. They provide you with all the products that you need and nothing you don't. I recommend you start with the level one system, which comes with all the basics, a daily face wash, an exfoliating scrub, an AM moisturizer with SPF 20, and a PM moisturizer. Oh, and to make it simple for guys like us, they provide this instruction card in every box that tells you how and when to use each product. It definitely comes in clutch. Skincare wasn't something I always took seriously, brothers, but now I wish I would have sooner. But well, you don't have to take my word for it, brothers. There are over 5,000 five-star reviews from customers around the globe. In addition to amazing skin, members of Tej Hanley get tons of benefits, including at least 20% off of retail price, access to exclusive monthly deals, the ability to pause or cancel at any time, and free U.S. shipping. And because Tej Hanley is sponsoring today's video, they're offering my viewers a great deal. Just click the first link in the description box and you'll get 30% off your first box, plus a free gift. Don't miss out on this amazing deal. Click that link and get started today. Again, brothers, life is just a series of new beginnings. And here's the thing, man. The thing is, you know too much. At this point of your journey, you know, you, you've been roaming the desert sands, right? At this point in your journey, man, you know too much to go back. In other words, what I'm saying is, you know, wh whatever, your, whatever your current reality was, something inside of you, that, that awareness inside of you was, 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 was woken up, right? You put your head above the clouds and you looked at everyone around you and said, you know what? Everyone around me is, is, is stagnant. Everyone around me is, is sleepwalking. It's time for me to elevate. It's time for me to move to my, 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 you know, the next version of myself. So you went to that stage of awareness, man, and you found yourself on the bridge. You find yourself in mid transition. And I'm going to tell you this, brother. And I tell my brothers in the circle this all the time. There's a level of peace to being on that bridge. But that, that bridge can be very dangerous as well, man. Because when you're on that bridge, you, you can see that new version of yourself. You know, the thoughts that you've had in your mind, the, the, you know, your new I am, you can see it. You, can, you understand it. If you keep going, if you keep walking in it, then your reality will change. But at the same time, brother, all you have to do is peek over your shoulder. And you can see those old people, old places, old things that are still pulling you back that are still hopping in DMs, that are still telling you to come to the same spots. And the thing is, which everybody knows this, when, you, when you're in that transition, man, it's all about sacrifice. It's all about giving up the things that, that are holding you back. And I'll be, I'll be honest, sometimes it's different for every man. Like sometimes I've been going through my cycles of transition and I had to completely cut out uh, uh, drinking. I'll say, you know what, during this transition, brother, I, I'm not touching any alcohol. Sometimes it's, I'm not touching any cigars. Back when I was young, it was like, you know what? I have to cut the club out. 
I have to cut certain things out, brother. So it's uh, it's all about identifying the things that are calling your name, that are that are that are begging you to come back, man, and eliminate those things in order to move forward. But I'll say this, brother. Of all the brothers that I talk to, of the consultations that I've had where brothers are saying, man, you know, it's something that's pulling me back to this old world. Like, I don't know, I can't fully transition. Of all these conversations, man, the primary source of a man not being able to move forward is a woman in his life. I'm going to say it again, man. Matter of fact, I'm going to pause and sip on some high quality H2O and let you and let you soak on that for a minute, brothers. Think about the times in your life when you were getting ready to make a huge change. Maybe take a huge job in another city. Maybe, maybe join the military. Maybe take, maybe take a, 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 on a new position that, that maybe shifted you overseas. Think about the primary thing that was holding you back. It wasn't your brothers. It wasn't that that club was just so lit that you couldn't leave that city. I'm going to tell you this, brothers. And it's a hard pill to swallow. A lot of times, a lot of times the thing that keeps a man from going to that next level is the woman in his life. And the thing is, the thing is, this is not an easy conversation because it, it, it's hard. That's one of the hardest things to disconnect yourself from. Those vices, nothing. Religion and all that kind of stuff, politics that holds you back, is nothing. Even, even certain people, even family members, sometimes that can be nothing to let go. But if that woman in your life, man, it, it, is causing you to not move forward, for some reason, man, for us men, that's a hard thing to, to sever ties with. It didn't make sense. It makes sense, man. A lot of you brothers are saying, man, well, well so uh, 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 Respucia has been in my corner this whole time, bro. Like, like she's been cutting for me. She's been doing all this stuff. And I understand. You say, brother, you know, when, when I had when, when I had nothing, bro, you, you know, and this woman was in my life, like, like, like she was there for me. Brother, I understand. And that's the reason why a man wants to evolve and do bigger and better things so he can put a, a better covering over, over a woman's life. But I'm going to tell you this, brother, and this is something that a lot of you brothers are going to learn the whole way, man. A, a, lot of, a lot of women, for some reason, they, they don't want to transition with you. You know, I, had, I was having a conversation with, with somebody, uh, and it's been a while back, and for some reason we were talking about uh, Kevin Hart's name came up. And they were saying, yeah, well, Kevin Hart started his career off. He was with his wife and this, this, this. And, and once he started to blow up, he left his wife. And, and in, my, in my mind, I'm thinking, well, on the outside, of course, it looks like that. But you, you have no idea what's going on going on, on the inside of, of a relationship, man. You have no idea. I'm going to say this. I, I, I'm going to say this, brother. A lot of times, a lot of times when a man is evolving, when a man is stepping into that higher version of himself, it's the people in your life, including your woman, they can't evolve with you. And a lot of times a man has to make a choice. A man, ha a man has to make a choice. Is it going to be me fulfilling, you know, you know, my I am? Is it going to be me living my purpose? Or is it going to be me, you know, uh, uh, being in love? And I'm, I'm gonna tell you this, brother. That that's not that's not the easiest of of that's not the easiest of thing thing easiest of things to go through, man. But you have you have to understand what's taking place, brothers. You have to understand that that woman in your life can be the thing that's holding you back. So so all I'm saying is, brothers, as, as we get the shaving things out of our life, man, understand understand that a woman that is your greatest asset can be the thing that's holding you back, brothers. You know, all I'm saying is this, brothers, and this is something we have to understand. During our, during our, you know, uh, uh, completion of cycles, during our transition to this new phase of life, man, the thing that a man must understand and must remember is that everything from that old world is not going to carry over into that new world. You know what I'm saying? Look at, look at brother uh, Job in the Bible. Brother Joe, brother Joe went through the exact same thing, man. He had his family, he had his friends, he had his, his, his cattle and all his real estate, man. And the whole time he was going through that transition, the whole time he was going through this illness, brother Joe was like, why don't y'all, like, why aren't y'all thinking like me? Why aren't y'all moving like me? And the whole time he's down and out, he's trying to drag his past over to his future with them, man. But at one point, at some point in time, brother Joe said, you know, I, I understand now. I got to let my partners go. 
Like I've been riding with y'all since since our youth, brother. But I gotta let y'all go. E- e- even the woman that was on his side was like, Joe, why are you moving like you're moving? And at some point, Joe had Job said, brother, so I got I gotta let you go. Not knowing that all of those things, those people, that wife, those blessings, like it was a whole new on the other side, man. That's what we have to understand as men. We have to understand that a lot of times, man, the things we're trying to trying to bring with us, they just can't go. They vibrate at a different frequency. These things in our lives no longer represent us. And that's everything, material things, vices, even people, brother. So just understand, man, that a lot of times, some stuff just have to get left behind. Brothers, don't forget about the amazing deal at Tiege Hanley. Click that link and get started today.